Alright guys, so today I have a pretty cool video to show you. Um, basically, I'm just going to be teaching you how I do my typical, you know, like go-to card trick where, you know, if somebody hands me a deck of cards and they say, hey man, can you, can you do a trick for me? This is going to be the trick that, uh, that I perform. So here's what it looks like. Okay, so to start off, what I typically do is have a spectator go ahead, just shuffle up the pack, and then what we do is take the top card, in this case, the nine of diamonds. We would put this into the middle of the deck somewhere, snap our fingers, and then have the nine come back to the top of the deck. So basically, you tell your spectator, listen, we can do this over and over and over again until you know we really get bored of bringing this nine back and forth from the top to the top of the deck again, right? So the next thing I do is just you know tell them, look, we can do this with any card in the deck. So in this case, let's say we take you know this top card, for example, the uh, the jack of hearts, right? You say, look, let's take this. I'll show you again one more time. Snap my fingers, and again, as you can see, the card comes back to the top. And at first, it makes it look like you know you messed up a little bit. But what you do is say, you know what, actually. What's that? You know, you can go behind the table, go behind your back, whatever, and flip it around and show your spectators, look, that actually was the Jack of Hearts um, the entire time. So if you guys are interested in learning how to do this, do not forget to stick around for the tutorial. All right, guys, so I know it's been a little bit since I've uploaded a video. I've actually been working on my uh, my aviation career, so I just re recently got my, my uh, private pilot license. So if you guys know what that is, basically it's like your license when you drive a car. Well, I finally got the license to drive. You know, fly a plane. So it's been a little bit off and on between YouTube and that, but anyways, I just you know wanted to just let you guys know why maybe I, I've been a little bit inconsistent. But anyways, um, to start this one off, this really is the first go-to card trick. You know, if somebody hands me a deck of cards, this is a trick you can do immediately. It takes no setup. You can have a spectator, you know, shuffle the deck and whatnot. So the first thing I do is do a double lift. So it doesn't matter. The spectator, you know, does whatever. You know, they can shuffle the deck. I do a double lift, flipping over the top two cards. I'll leave a link for that. Um, on the screen and then what you do is you put that second card in the middle and you know the card obviously stays on top of the deck so at this point what I do is a Marlow tilt and I'll leave a link on the screen for that as well essentially all you're doing is putting that card in the second position of the deck right so I didn't do anything special I just put it in the second position um, but made it look like I was putting it in the middle of the deck so I'll leave a link for that basically you do a double lift and a Marlow tilt and then from here you can move on to the next step. So at this point, you just tell your spectators, listen, you know, we can go on all day, um, you know, putting this card to the middle, bring it back to the top. You can tell your spectators, like, we can do this with any card. And the next thing you do is a triple lift. So instead of just lifting over two cards, you do the same concept with three cards, okay? So you lift over three cards. In this case, you know, the top card looks like the seven of spades. And what you do is you say, okay, you know what, let's go ahead, let's put this card back into the middle snap our fingers and then once again you do a double lift right so, or actually no sorry you do a single lift so you flip it over and it's not the seven of spades so you flip it over just one card and you say actually you know what um hold on let me see let me see something maybe the card is underneath the table and then at this point all you're doing you know if you have a table where you can just stick your hand underneath or you can do it in front of the spectators their seven of spades you know the third card down is actually right here underneath all you're doing is pushing your finger over, and I'll leave a link for the shape shifter change. Just take the card on top. You can do a shake shifter change in front of them. You know, if you want to, just shake it up. And you can show them that the seven of spades has actually risen to the top. So I just wanted to give you guys a little idea. You know, this is this truly is the trick I do. Like if somebody says, you know, hey, you know, can you do a trick for me right now? And you know, if they give me a deck, I'll have them shuffle it and do this little. You know, it's a slight ambitious card routine mixed in with like a shapeshifter, so it's super easy to kind of get them like, you know, you have a visual change, you have um, a couple lifts, like I said, you know, it's, it's pretty interesting. So anyways, guys, um, if you actually want to see, you know, more of my airplane videos, I've taken a couple of videos of me flying. If you're interested in that, make sure to leave down in the comments if you want to see some videos. Um, but if not, guys, I will see you in the next one. So thanks for watching.